Now, for more updates on this story, we are joined by Isa Nakvi, our correspondent in Islamabad. Thank you for joining us, Isa. A much anticipated meeting between Pakistan and the Taliban was held. So, what is the outcome of the Taliban and Pakistan meeting? Oh, well, uh, the offic official handout of the meeting uh, says that the meeting went very well. It was positive, and both Pakistan and Taliban agreed upon the need uh, for an early resumption of dialogue between Taliban and the U.S. So the very exercise uh, which Pakistan wanted to facilitate uh, that uh, this process of talks, the Doha talks that were scuttled between uh, the Taliban and the U.S., uh, that shall resume. And now uh, the fact that uh, U.S. Special Envoy Zalme Khalil Zad is in uh, Pakistan and the Taliban delegation is also in Pakistan. The first meeting uh, that has officially being confirmed by the Foreign Office of Pakistan was a delegation level meeting between Taliban and the Foreign Minister of Pakistan in which both the side agreed upon the need for resumption of dialogue. Uh, the Taliban delegation, as it is being said, is going to stay uh, for a little while uh, in Islamabad and will be holding other meetings as well. They are expected to call on Prime Minister Imran Khan as well and they are going to hold uh, meetings. But although uh, an official uh, confirmation of their meeting with Zalma Khalil Zad is awaited, but the sources, they claim uh, that uh, this meeting is going to take place today. And Isa, also tell us uh, what are the policies of a, uh, the continuation of the peace talks between Taliban and the United States? Uh, now, so far, what we have seen uh, coming out of uh, the meeting uh, between Taliban delegation and foreign minister and also uh, the uh, press release that has been issued by the spokesperson of Taliban, uh, they have actually agreed upon uh, the continuation and the resumption of the dialogue. And the very fact that Zalma Khalilzad came to Islamabad was obviously for this reason that after uh, the process was started last month and it was announced by uh, the president of the United States. States, Donald Trump, and then uh, Pakistan offered uh, that Pakistan could help facilitate uh, this talk process to resume, and uh, it was agreed upon that there is no military solution to the Afghan conflict. So, uh, what has happened now that uh, there is a positive gesture from the uh, the U.S. side, from the Taliban side, and Pakistan as well. So, uh, the Pakistan as a facilitator and uh, Taliban and the U.S. as negotiators, they all uh, seem to be on the same page. Uh, so we. Uh, can actually uh, uh, listen to an official confirmation of resumptions, resumption of dialogue soon. But as the spokesperson of the Foreign Ministry of Pakistan, Dr. Mohammad Faisal, in his briefing, said today that this is a very delicate matter. And uh, it is uh, like a deliberate attempt that uh, media is not being given the technical details of all the meetings that are taking place. Right, Isa, moment. media has not been given the technical details. Thank you very much for your update on the meeting between Taliban and Pakistan.